So I have this thing, um, this is probably the fourth dead hummingbird that I found in my lifetime. And as you can see, he just, this is a male hummingbird. Um, I forget the specific species, but check this out. Um, uh, I'm gonna read um, five meanings um, of finding a dead hummingbird. So um, here we go. By the way, this is um, Shadea, the lesbian believer. And sometimes I just find some of the strangest things, but. Uh, the first meaning of finding a dead hummingbird is commitment, a symbol of being ready for fully committing to a partner or project. Number two, love, a reminder to stop and take pleasures in life's love and the ability to feel and spread love to those around you. You know, especially in these times, like no matter how, like what's going on, like a lot of people are afraid and, um, you know, fear looks like anger sometimes. And so you gotta just like walk in, um, in love. Like people know it and, you know, they may not, say anything right away but when they get to where they're going like you know if they have um they're not an empty vessel they'll take that in and, and it'll do wonders for them um the third meaning is change and renewal if you see a dead hummingbird it can be a positive that's just that change is on its way number four rest if you're visited by a, a hummingbird dead or alive it can be a symbol that the worst is over or about to be over and finally number five mistakes and regret so this little guy i gotta find a nice burial for him sorry that he's he's gone but he's a good omen for um all that are listening you may be holding on to the past mistakes or harboring a lot of regret for things you cannot change you know re releasing surrendering is like a, a good idea but i don't want to go too far in depth i just want to make this video very short um i hope you guys are having a wonderful sunday they're doing the uh, long beach pride um festival here in long beach today they had the parade this morning I made it a point not to attend because I just don't resonate with any of it anymore. I never really have, but you know, that's neither here nor there. I decided to work instead and it's a beautiful day. I hope you guys are enjoying Sunday as much as I am. Anyways, I hope this has been insightful and I hope this message uh, meets those that are meant to hear it. Goodbye and have a wonderful Sunday and a great week actually. Great start to the week. Start it right.